You're watching another Nerd Stalker interview. Startup Blog Insights, the top 10. Number nine. So let's go to number nine here. Focus is important, but so is agile thinking. So this is, uh, yeah, one of the ones from I think uh, May of this year, right? Yeah, uh, you know, you can you can have uh, a goal in mind, and you can try to work keep you know keep your vision on that goal. But if you're not careful, uh, you know, an opportunity could have arisen that you could have capitalized on that could have been ten times better than the goal you were focused on, or you you might have. Um, Missed move, you know. Missed that there were roadblocks that would keep you from achieving your goal, and not have realized alternate paths to get to the goal you were trying to achieve. And so the agile thinking is is keep your focus, keep you know, uh, always keep the vision on where you're trying to get to. But don't forget to look around once in a while <laughs> and pay attention, and don't forget you know to think ahead and plan for for uh, roadblocks that can keep you from reaching your goal. Well, you know, one of the advice I think you gave me earlier this year also when we were talking about this agile thinking was um, I think I was doing some planning with a business partner of mine, and what I found out is that as I started to think a little bit more agilely about, you know, uh, planning, uh, we pivoted our idea several times, actually, before yeah. we actually wanted to say, hey, maybe it's ready for funding. So, Absolutely. Uh, and yeah. I, yeah. So, so it's, it's a matter of... of Keeping an open mind, looking at alternatives, um, even though you continue to proceed towards the goal you're trying to achieve, don't forget that something else could occur. So if you're trying to create a product and all of a sudden find out that that product, just a minor tweak, could make it for a totally different market that's worth 10 times the value, you don't want to miss that. Yeah, absolutely.